Hey everyone, I'm Ritu. I'm here to show you a really cool OSINT website called What's My Name, which is a website for username enumeration. So what does that even mean? If you're working on an OSINT investigation and you have the username of a target, say from their email address, they call themselves redbeard007 at yahoo.com, well, you have a username of redbeard007 that you can enter on What's My Name. So let's go ahead and try that. So here I enter the username, I click on the magnifying glass, and we can go ahead and see that a bunch of different results will display. Of course, you do need to verify and validate that this is all related to your target. Um, one neat feature they recently updated was when you click on any of these results, it will open up into a new window. So it makes that back and forth a lot easier. Um, what you'll also see is you, you can download the results in CSV or PDF if that's helpful to you. What you can also do is use the Forensic OSINT browser extension to make the capture. So here I have a case name called What's My Name, and I'm going to click on Capture Full Page. Okay, it looks like we're done here. You can review current capture in the case management system, which is built into the app. And let's go to the file. So here you're going to see the capture. You're going to see if you scroll down, everything's included there. You can include notes here if you'd like. And finally, you would download your capture from here. And again, if you wanted to go back and you wanted to capture just an individual page, same thing. You would open up Forensic OSINT. You can say current uh, capture current screen and you would make that capture. And then when you go into the case management system, you open up your case name. You can see that that capture is there for you. And again, you can download from here. We looked at what's my name dot app, which is a, a username enumeration tool and how that can add value to your OSINT investigation, but also how you can document your research as you go using the Forensic OSINT browser extension. Thanks so much for watching today.